we're going to do here is we're going to show you how you can trim uh, a base molding without having to use baseboard notches for a panel that needs to run down to the floor with all of the baseboard and the carpeting and everything already installed using this great new tool. So if this gable, for example, needed to go right there like that, we would just put it in the position, the desired position, after we had figured everything out. We'd put a couple of marks on that, uh, that piece of baseboard, just where we wanted that thing to fit. And then we'd run over to Home Depot and we'd pick up this new tool, which is basically uh, an end cutting, a molding end cutter that you use for this type of application. What it does is, is it does a nice straight line right down to any kind of obstruction without making a mess. So, there we go. I'm just going to work my way up. nice perfect little straight line no mess now I'm going to do the other side that took up all of about two minutes. Now what I'm going to, oh I don't even need a knife. There you see that. So now you want to fit that gable in there just like that. Perfect fit. A little bit of caulking in there.